From the studios at WBONTV.com, here's what's happening. A disturbance at Baptist Health in Richmond has landed one man in jail. Marissa Hempel files this report. Richmond police were called to Baptist Health, Richmond, early Sunday morning to investigate a report of trespassing. When authorities arrived at the scene, they found that Ronnie Allen had locked himself in a bathroom inside the hospital. Baptist Health officials advised the officer that Allen had been discharged earlier, but returned and then refused to leave the premises. Allen was lodged in the Madison County Detention Center, where he was charged with public intoxication, disorderly conduct, and criminal trespassing. I'm Marissa Hempel. Madison County deputies were called to a home on Carver's Ferry Road in regards to a woman possibly wanted on warrants. As they arrived, they saw 32-year-old Angie Bratcher leaving the residence. During questioning, Bratcher reportedly gave officers false information. She was arrested for first-degree criminal abuse of a child 12 or younger, tampering with physical evidence and buying and possessing drug paraphernalia, and giving officers false information. Berea will soon be getting a new city administrator, and he's a familiar name to the city. He is Police Chief David Gregory. He says he's a visionary but ask citizens to have patience while he learns his new position. For the next couple of months, just ask for patience, uh, understanding. Let me learn this position in the next uh, year. I love to work hard, uh, so I will work as hard as I can to do the best for the citizens. Gregory replaces retiring Administrator Randy Stone. Residents of six apartments are looking for temporary housing after an alleged impaired driver crashed into a vehicle, knocking it into the apartment complex. It happened at around 6.40 Monday night at Meridian Apartments on Armstrong Road in Lexington. For more stories like these, tune to WBONTV.com. I'm Ron Likens.